What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back everyone, this is Lee, and yes, today's today we'll be talking about your auto area autofocus for your Nikon Z62. So, without further ado, let's begin. Now, the auto area autofocus for your Nikon Z62. Now, this setting right here is probably my favorite setting when I'm shooting birds or any subject behind a plain background, right? So, in my case, this is a bald eagle right here, and it's coming, you know, towards me. And of course, the background is all blue, right? Now, with this whole setup right here, I don't need to worry about any blackouts. I just let the camera focus on the bird. It seems to hit most of the shots. Yeah, it seems to hit most of the shots. I was pretty pleased with it. Here is another example where I'm hitting a hawk. Now, as you can see, I don't get all my shots in focus, but the camera did most of the work. And the best thing about the setting is, I don't need to worry about the blackouts. When you're using dynamic area autofocus, you have to focus on your subject and then fight the blackout, right? For this setting, I don't need to worry about the blackouts, right? I just gotta focus on the subject because the camera is actually doing most of the work for me and that is a great user experience right there. Now, when you are shooting the subject in a complex scene, uh, it's a totally different story. Really, it works, but most of the time it does not work. I just feel that there were moments where I sat there and I was thinking to myself, wow, maybe someone at Nikon needs to adjust the algorithm or something because the target is so close to the subject. I don't know what is going on, but it just, it just you know, boggles my mind. But uh, I think there is something, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not behind the machine learning over at Nikon team right there, but if they could figure how to like, snap onto the subject that's moving in the scene. Well, everything else is moving in the scene if you're focusing on the bird. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that is a complex situation right there. But at times I felt like the camera could have focused on the bird. It's literally right there in the scene, but no, it focused mainly on the background. It focused like the water. It's, it's, it's complex. That is something you guys should know. So with all that said, I'm going to end this video. I'm gonna show you guys some clips of my slideshow of what I've just shot with this setting and you guys get to look at everything. So with all that said, thank you guys for checking me back. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely click like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Take it easy, peace.